Welcome back to our channel. Today, we'll be discussing an interesting story concerning Apple's reluctance to embrace the latest advancements in chatbot AI. Specifically, we'll be talking about Apple's decision to prevent the Blue Mail email client from releasing an update that would have integrated the ChatGPT chatbot into the software. The issue arises with Apple's stance on AI-produced content, with the company requiring that any such content that is added to an app must include either content filtering or age restrictions. The developers behind Blue Mail, Blix Incorporated, argue that their application already has content filtering in place, so such measures are unnecessary. Furthermore, they point to the fact that other apps on the store with similar AI capabilities do not have any age restrictions in place, so they feel they're being unfairly targeted. The AI in question is from OpenAI, and is designed to automate the process of email writing by taking into account previous emails, calendar events, and other content. Apple has said that the App Review Board is currently investigating the complaint made by the developers of Blue Mail. This rejection reflects Apple's general attitude to AI in comparison to other tech companies. For example, Microsoft, a large backer of OpenAI, recently implemented its models into its search engine Bing. But, the smartphone version of the app with AI integration is only accessible to users over the age of 17 on the iPhone, whereas on the Android version of the app there are no restrictions. This isn't the first instance of Apple attempting to impose age restrictions on AI-enabled applications. Back in March, the company attempted to produce similar restrictions on the popular iOS game and app Ludo King, which uses AI-generated content. However, the developers behind that game were also successful in their defense of its suitable for all age audiences. We can see that Apple is more concerned with the risks of AI than other big tech companies, and its reluctance to join the current arms race between Microsoft and Google over AI technology. However, its CEO, Tim Cook, has recently suggested that AI is a major focus for the company, so perhaps it's only a matter of time until Apple does join in. Thank you for tuning into our discussion on Apple's stance on AI, and we hope you found it interesting. To stay up to date with all the latest news, don't forget to sign up for the Tech Radar Pro newsletter.